Hey, it's Chris with HoopsKing.com and these are the Hoops King Defender Extenders and I'm going to show you in a minute all the different ways these can help you improve your team and your game. You can use the Defender Extenders to work out a triple threat. So he's going against a longer, more taller athletic player. I can challenge his shot. I can challenge his drive. So now he has to work on moving the defender. And that's the key to the defender extenders is you must learn to move the defense if you're gonna be a good player against longer, taller, more athletic players. So if he's here, if I challenge, he can work on his pump fakes, work on getting me up, getting me moving. He can jab step, try to get me to move. He can I can challenge his dribble, he can sweep through, he can sweep through, all right? So he's just gonna work on all the things you would have triple threat with the defender extenders. Another use of the defender extender is full court dribbling. So if I'm 6'6 and he's 5'10, he better learn to protect the basketball from me. So when we go full court dribble and just dribble real slow, okay, I can reach in and get the ball. So he's got to work on getting that arm up, protecting the basketball. Okay. He's got to work on getting my hips turned. So go back now, Cameron. Okay. So if he's get, here's here's the key to beating somebody at full court off the dribble. He's got to take two hard dribbles and get just go slow. Two hard dribbles. One. Two, now he's going wide again. He's got to go straight at me, go back. Because I will eat him alive. If he, my length this way, I win. My length this way, he's going to win. So he's got to get me here. He's got to get my hips turned. He can't allow me just to go side to side and control him. He's got to control me. So he's got to come right at me here. Now he gets my hips turned. Look where my length is. Now we're perpendicular. My length is perpendicular. This does me no good. This length does me absolutely no good over here against him, and I can't do much there either. Again, when I'm here, I got him. My length kills him every time. So he's got to work on getting my hips turned in full court dribbling is going to be a key, and protecting the basketball, okay? If he's, here's a mistake a lot of players make. They put the basketball right by their foot out where somebody can still reach it and knock it away, okay? If I'm 6'6", six, six, he's in big trouble. So now, here's how he's going to protect the basketball. He's going to put it behind his hip. So dribble the ball down, put your arm down, I want to show him. I can't reach in there and get, there's nothing there. He's got the ball behind his hip, it's protected. Now if he adds the arm, it's even protected more against somebody who's tall. I can't get in there and get that. Okay, let's just slide down the court here quick and take a look at it. So just slide dribble, protect it back. I'm trying to get in there, I'm trying to get in there. Okay, so you can see how that will help you with your full court dribbling. Just another example. Another great use, obvious, work on the arc of the shot. So I'll just do closeouts. We could have a line he shoots. He's got to shoot up over the stick. Go ahead and get it, a couple more reps. So again, if you got a team going, you're just holding it up to each kid to help them get their arc because you're going to have those kids with poor arc and this is just a really easy, quick way to get them to shoot over something. Another great use of the defender extenders in the post, you may have a kid on your team that's six, eight inches taller than everybody else. Well, how's he going to get better in practice if he's six, six going against five, ten kids all day? The defender extender is a great solution. So you can either give them to the players or as coaches when you're working on your drills. This isn't a, tr a situation where he's taller, but if it was, again, he would pivot in. Just pivot it, no, pivot into the middle. He would pivot in. I would be right there to challenge him. And now, again, he's going to have to learn to move the defense. So if you got a taller kid in practice who's not getting challenged, get the defender extenders and make him learn to move the defense. So beating smaller players will become even easier. But then when he starts to see people his own size, he will already know what to do. The thing I love most about the defenders extenders is you teach players on offense how to move the defense through pumps, fakes, jab steps, protecting the basketball in the full court, uh, in the post, you're working on moving the defense. You're always working on controlling the defender and not letting the defender control you. And that's what these can do. They can really show flaws in people's games really quick. So if you just click this other video, it's a bit longer, but it really explains in detail and shows you some of those flaws that players will have that they may not see until they get to another level and players are longer and taller and athletic. Don't wait till you get to the next level. Play at the, prepare for the next level now with the Defender Extender Sticks.